my heart sculptures has a door on the front that has a lock, and then when you open the door, there's a mirror back there, but um, that was a nice, made the door frame and the jam and the hinges and, and the whole, like, the hasp and everything. And the entire assembly? Yeah, of course. Um, just not the lock. I wanted the vintage, because I was using recycled steel sure. from a, a painted drum, so I wanted this little, I got the perfect, because it was red paint that was worn off, and right. I found this perfect little vintage lock with red paint that was worn off. Same oh. color. Everything. Perfect. Um, but I, so, a lot of my sculptures have copper and steel, especially the heart sculptures. Yeah, you like to mix metals. I do, um, because it's like paint. So. Well, everything's one color with steel. Right. You get a few different colors with steel. <laughs> shiny and not shiny. Um, so, I really like doing these hidden connections with the copper, with the steel, and um, either there'll be some connection to the back, or the, um, one of the ones that I like a bunch is uh, her surrounding the copper heart, and uh, you have to get your hand just in the right spot behind the copper to unscrew the screws that are holding it all together. <laughs> so when you say hidden connections, do you mean cold fasteners, like rivets, or bolts? But not welding. Right? Not welding, no, because uh, welding copper and steel doesn't really make you happy. No, they don't make you happy. No. You can do you it. You can do bronze, but not copper. Um, no, yeah, I like, and I like to be able, because uh, I don't usually have a show, like, right in my shop, so I have to transport things, and copper is very delicate, and the, the patina that I'll put on it is going to be delicate, so I want to store things separately. I don't want the copper and the steel in the same, you know, like, always touch. So I like to take it apart and wrap the copper here to steal here and then put it together later. So you, you take it to install it for the show and it's some assembly required. Mm -hmm. So each time you have to 